Hey everybody, welcome to Witcher Math Channel and my Shopkins Math video number one. All right, today we're looking at Penny Pencil, Snippy the Scissors, uh, Chatter the Old School Phone. Yeah, that's a telephone. You might not know what that is, but it's not a cell phone. Then there's Kelly the Calculator. Some people might call that a calculator. And then here's Stella the Stapler and Noni Notebook. All right, I have six of them if you just counted them. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. There's Chatter and six. So you can see we have six of them, right? Well, that was easy. Now let's do something a little more exciting. Get over there, guys. Here we go. Okay, so we've got six of them. Let's start with a little basic math, all right? Now, since you already know we have six, what would happen if I put them like this? Whoa, sorry, Penny. I didn't mean to make you dizzy and put you upside down there. What if I did that? How many are over here in this group? One, two, three, right? And how many are over here? One, two, three. That also makes three. How many do we have? Do you remember? Well, you can just count all of them, right? We have six. Total, T-O-T-A-L. So three and three gives us six. Here's a little math for you. When you see the word and, or when you say it, put that there, okay? We call that a plus sign, okay? We use that to add things together to get more. And then when you see we have, or if you're saying there is or there are, then you're going to use an equal sign. So here's this problem. Three Shopkins and three more Shopkins makes six Shopkins. Okay, excuse me guys. I'm gonna move you off the paper there. We're gonna do one more problem. Okay. All right. So now we have, how many, do you remember? Go ahead and count them if you don't remember, but you did remember. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. We have six Shopkins. Now what happens if I take away three of them? What's left? What is left. How many? There's still three left, right? Okay, so we get to learn one new thing here, and that is when I say take away, I use this little line here, and you might call that a minus sign. And what's left is another way of saying the equal sign, okay? So here's our last problem of the day. We started with how many? Six. Then we took away minus three. And then what's left, that's the equal sign. There were still three left, okay? Thanks for watching. The first Shopkins video for math to get you started using some of your favorite toys and also some awesome math to get you really working hard and knowing your numbers. Hey, stay tuned for more exciting Shopkins math videos coming soon on the Witcher Math channel. See you later, guys.